So we're going to start in the corner and we're going to walk from the corner to the center. Now the arms are relaxed. Remember that this is not a pure classical variation. So we will be doing some more contemporary movements. So starting from a crossover position, we're going to peel the foot off the floor and come into a devil pay devon. Arms are gonna come to four. And then from there, we're going to, at the same time, pivot the underneath foot and do a grand rond de jambe en l'air. So passing through second, and then stop the underneath foot so you can hold the turn out and continue the leg all the way around to the back into an arabesque position. So you saw also that my arms went from fourth to second to an arabesque position. And now from here, we're going into a pas de bourre. So bending the supporting leg and then bringing the back leg in, back, side and then we're going to close front into a demi plie ready for a pas de basque so from here head goes towards the back arm comes to first and then we're going to rotate that leg a la seconde and remember that rond de jambe needs to go all the way around to the back corner transfer the weight close the other leg and then we're going to do a chasse into an arabesque line with the arms tendu derriere from here, we're breaking with the classical lines and we're gonna turn the front arm over and then bring the back arm all the way round and turn the hand over again. And then from there, we touch palms, we go down and then the arms come inside and then up, palms together. So let me show you those arms a little bit closer now. So the back arm comes over, both palms facing up, then rotate inwards towards yourself Allow the wrists to rotate, join the palms together in the middle, and then continue the upwards movement of the arms. So let's do that full speed now. So arm comes over, we lunge, in and up, and then from there, I'm gonna show you the arms first. We're going to bring the arms down, through kind of a second position, head towards the back arm, and then it changes to the front arm as we come into demi-second. But of course we don't turn with flat feet, we turn with the feet in releve. So let's do up to there with the music. From here we're going to learn the legs first, we're going to step forward and then that back leg's going to lift up into arabesque. We're going to bring the heel in, make sure the knee stays lifted, don't drop it. Keep it coming into the back of the knee and then we're going to rotate inwards and then all the way around to the other corner. So let's go slowly with arms now. Again we step forward, arms from here are going to come up, palms are going to join at the top of the head. As they join, we're gonna to start to lift up the back leg into arabesque. As we lift, the arms are gonna come down to the front of the chest, keeping the elbows out to the side. Now, again, back heels coming in. Remember, keep the knee lifted all the way into the back of the knee. At the same time, we start to rotate on fast. From here, we're gonna come into a parallel position. So knee comes in and then all the way around, arms are gonna open a la seconde as we turn round and then we're going to continue the movement with a port de bras so through fourth to the other fourth and then open let's do that a bit faster so leg comes in we open the arms to second all the way around to the other corner arms come through fourth to the other fourth and then we're actually going to transfer the weight and arms come to arabesque from this position we're going to lunge and allow the back foot to slide along the floor at the same time, the front arm comes in and presents. As we extend the front leg, from there, the back arm's going to start coming over and then we're going to do a little cambray. Arms are circling back and then all the way up. Bring that leg back in, in a bent position. Remember to keep the knee open, foot turned out. And from there, we're going to open the leg to the side and brush it round to the front to do kind of like a soutenu but more contemporary version 
and then we're going to walk to the other corner to repeat on the other side. So let's do that second part with music. We're going to repeat that whole section on the other side. So we start walking in from the other corner and we start with the other leg. Devil pay devon. Arms come to fourth. From there we pivot and grand rond de jambe at the same time round to the other corner. Arabesque. Fondue. Pas de bourre. Close. Pas de basque. Remember leg to the other corner. Transfer through fourth to the arabesque line. Fondue derriere. From there, turn the front hand over. Back arm comes round and down, both palms facing up, and then inwards and up, palms together. Towards the back leg, we go all the way round, stop facing the other corner, and step forward. Arms are coming up. Remember, palms are going to join at the top, back leg comes into arabesque. Bring the palms down to the chest. From there, rotate that leg inward, all the way round to the other corner. Continue the movement into a corps de bras with a cambray. Transfer the weight. From there, we go lunge down. Rotate the front arm round. Extend the front leg. From there, cambray back. Bring the front leg in and then round again. And then we're going back to the original corner this time. So let's do this whole side with music. I cut the middle section of music out just so that the variation wasn't as long so we're going into the final section now and this will be with the final part of the music. So starting in first position we're going to chasse and do three chenets so that's one, two and three and then we're going to bring that foot across and come into an attitude position so it's the back leg that comes up into attitude, arms are going to come down into this position which is just very typical of the Arabian variation. From there, we're going to pivot to the other corner, bring that leg through, and from there, we're going to prepare to this time PK into our chenets, but it's the same. So we do one, and two, and three. Bring the foot across, and we're stepping into that attitude position again. Arms come up and then down, releasing the wrists. From there, we're going to rotate again, promenade. Keeping the knee lifted, bring that leg through. And this is the very final section. We're going to do three arabesques. So we can do like a low arabesque and down. And every time we PK up into the arabesque. And then the final one we can do a little bit bigger all the way up. Rotate the arms around and then you're just going to run off. And that's the end of the variation. Let's just do those three arabesques again full speed. So we're in the attitude position. Remember, we're going to promenade round, bring the leg through, and then from there we do the first arabesque, step up, straight knee, second arabesque, again, straight knee in the pique, third arabesque, bring the arms round, and then run off. So here we go, that final section with music, and then we'll put it all together.
So now it's time to dance the full variation. Well done, this is one of the longest variations I've ever done for beginners, so well done for getting through it. I just want to remind you guys that I have my free mini course on how to hold your turnout. I will leave the links in the description box and also my pro leg lines course which is especially for beginners and improvers so you can really get to grips with like the ballet line and work with your legs to make the most of the turnout, the knees, the hips, the feet that you already have and learn how to make those into lovely leg lines for ballet. So I'll leave all the details in the description box below. Thank you so much for watching this video guys and I will see you in my next one which will be, very excitingly, the point version of this variation. <laughs> so I'll see you then. Bye!